Oh, yes, of course. Okay, I'm all right, no problem. I slipped in the crab. Who put that crab there? Crab? I didn't see any crab. Don't tell me. There were two crabs. They work in pairs. Despite this current crisis, the president is putting on his best political face. Benson's 20-point lead in the poll six months ago has plummeted since the hostage crisis began. The CNN Victoria's Secret catalog poll now has the president and Edwards running neck and neck. This afternoon, Benson made a brief stop in Fergus Falls, Virginia, for the groundbreaking of his presidential library. Sabotage. My God, man, what does it mean? We have to tighten security, sir. Find out who's behind it. No, no, no. The word, sabotage. What does it mean? Gotcha! Let's get the door, huh? Uh, well, Walters, looks like we've got our saboteur. That's your wife, sir. Huh? Yeah, so it is. If Edwards gets wind of this, he'll use it against you in the campaign. He'll try to prove that you're incompetent. I can prove that as well as he can. President Benson, where is your first lady? My first lady? Hell, I don't know. I've had a lot of women. Lost my flower at the tender age of 15. I can't keep track of all of them. Prime Minister Tojo, Senator Edwards, my fellow Americans, and our millions of illegal aliens. It seems like only yesterday I was strafing so many of your homes. Here I am today begging you not to make such good cars. President Benson. No, you're not. Seen him on television. He's an older man, about my height. We're keeping this one on the QT. We're calling it secret mission to go in and get Walters and our boys back. How is the speech coming, sir? Huh? Oh, I'm back to my A's. Does this look like an A to you? Yes, sir. All right. Every time I give an order, things get screwed up. Plan a reception, they bring the wrong hors d'oeuvres. Point an ambassador, the next thing you know, he leaves the country. There's the target area. It's Minnesota, sir. Oh, damn it, man. That's the genius of my plan. We don't have to traipse all over the world to fight. We can do it right here at home, get us some good fishing while we're at it. Sir, the enemy is over there. Then we'll fly them over here. They can bring their relatives. We'll teach them to ice skate. Do I have to think of everything? But a word of advice. Don't go around calling yourself the president. I wouldn't do that, and I don't think you should either. It just doesn't hold water. 